I have here Huawei Nexus 6P and let me show you how to go through the initializing setup process on the following phone. Of course, let's start from the welcome panel. Here you can activate a list of all the languages that you can use on your device. In my case, let me choose English, for instance, from United States. You can also choose emergency right here to open the phone's dialer and use emergency calls. Let's go back. You can go next by tapping let's go right here. You can add the SIM card, but you can also skip it and activate your phone without the SIM card. So let me do it. You can uh, choose either you would like to copy your data from your other device such as iPhone or Android, it doesn't really matter, or just if you would like to set up your phone as a new to get a fresh start. Let me choose the second way. You can connect to one of the Wi-Fi, it's not necessary, you can tap don't use any network for setup, but you can enable some interesting features by using your internet connection. So let me connect to one of my Wi-Fi. The device is checking for updates, let's wait a few seconds. Excellent. And now you can add a Google account to your phone. You can skip this point. You can also create a new Google account by using more options right here. And you can also use your older device, use your old Google account. So let me do it. Let's input my email. Let me correct my email to my Gmail account. Let's tap next. Then you have to input your password, so let me do it. And now all you have to do is simply tap next right here to go further. You can and you should even accept two terms and conditions of the following Google account. So let's tap I agree. The phone is checking info and getting account information so let's wait a couple of seconds excellent you can add a fingerprint to your device to use it or you can do it later in settings so let me skip for now the following screen let's tap skip choose skip anyway you can change some settings of Google services, for example, you can enable or disable automatically backup device data, use Google's location service to help apps, improve location accuracy, help improve your Android experience. Let me leave all of these features enabled and let's tap next. Tap continue. You can give the Google app permission to help you. Help you. This is all specification, you can tap yes, I mean, or no thanks. Let me choose no thanks for now. You can choose some settings right here, or you can tap all set and start using your device, so let me do it. Excellent, tap got it, and as you can see, now you can use your phone. Thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel and leave thumbs up under the video.